the day. Welcome to Kimo's Everything. We're going to look at the PlayStation 1, original PlayStation collection today. There's probably maybe 80 to 100 here. Not a huge collection, but a pretty darn big collection. And I think you're going to be surprised. We're just going to go through the first batch here. And, you know, if you see anything that you think, man, that one's special, that one's special, post in the comments. We'll go for the, these here that are on the table. And then we got box, which that's the cream of the crop. I think I'd be kind of surprised because uh, PlayStation, lots and lots of games, not all gems, some really good, some that didn't sell very well, that should have, and I think that's later on in this video. So let's look at what we got here first, just all these loose ones here, and I need a drinky poo because I'm going to be talking for a bit here. Hold on. Ah, put that there. And this here, for some reason, I think this is my favorite game, Sledstorm. Especially if you play two-player, it's snowmobiling. But if you like snowmobiling, I think this is the one. Especially, I think, if you've got a person to play with, uh, that's what really makes this game fantastic. Great music, good graphics, a lot of fun. And that's what a game should be about. So that's that one. And, of course, you're going to have some sports games in NBA Shoot 2000. In NCAA Game Breaker 99, a lot of these. PGA Tour. And I think you're going to kind of see a theme here. A lot of uh, golfing ones. That Tiger Woods made a lot of games. Uh, Snowcross. Supercross. I did a video on this. This is a great game. Dukes of Hazard. If you like the Dukes of Hazard, remember that from the 80s? Great game. Really great game to have. I want to put that over here. I want to play that one again. Hardcore 4x4. And Namco Museum Volume 1. I have this on every platform. Fantastic. I really love the classic games. Really great. I want to put this one aside, too. And there's one without a case. Super Sponge. Oh, a SpongeBob one. Looks like it's missing the front cover. Centipede. Oh, yeah, baby. This is really a good game. Really good game. I'm going to put that over here, too. i got to start playing some of these. Treasures of the Deep. You see, this was a Goodwill one, $2.99. Spider-Man, another $2.99 one. Let's see. Equestrian Showcase. Oh, here's one I've not played before. I'll put those over here. And, of course, Triple Play Baseball. Army Man World War. Actually, a pretty decent game. A lot of fun. Here's Street Racer. And it's kind of like a Mario Kart. Of course, everybody's favorite, Crash. This is Crash 2. Great games. Oh, here you go. You ready, guys? Mary, Kate, and Ashley, baby. Winner's Circle. Pac-Man World. Fantastic game. I remember playing this through Bleem on, on the emulator. Great game, especially on the PC. Uh, Star Wars Demolition. There's Rayman. What's this one? Rush. Look, this is the front cover. Some of these might be missing the front covers. Championship Motorship. I had bought a whole bunch of these, uh, like at garage sales and things like that. Uh, 007. Bugs Life. Actually, a good game. A lot of fun. And this is Destruction Derby. I'm going to play this one. I'm going to put this one aside, too. Smackdown 2. These are a lot of fun, especially if you got a friend to play with. You can beat each other. A lot of fun to do that. And another one of my favorite games, Croc. It's just a fun game. It's just a fun game. You can play for quite a long time, and it's kind of like almost kind of open worldish, where you got to find all. I can't remember what you got to find. Some gems or something. Really great game. Uh, cool Borders 3. Cool Borders 4. This in the case. Oh, another Pac Man World. There may be some duplicates. Uh, Arcade's Greatest Hits. Great. I love these Midway ones and stuff like that. A lot of fun. Of course, Activision Classics. Of course, the original Atari 2600. I'm going to put that one aside, too. The next Tetris. Love Tetris. My favorite game of all time. This is a really good port or good uh, version of it. Uh, Toonstein, Dare to Scare. And this one I kind of sort of liked. Uh, they put a lot of effort into the graphics. Gameplay, it's just basically go left, go right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Sims Deluxe Edition. Let's see, is this a PlayStation game, Lords of Magic? I don't think this is a PlayStation game. No, that don't belong in here. Killer Loop. And of course, we have some more wrestling. Mayhem. Grand Theft Auto 2. Going very old school with this bad boy. If you like the Grand Theft Auto. I really recommend playing the first version, second version. Kind of neat to see kind of where that came from. 
uh, Test Drive 5. Here's Crash Bandicoot, the first one. Here's, of course, the Greatest Hits Edition. Put that there. Get that over there a little bit. Let me get a sippy poo. Ah, good stuff. Uh, NBA Live 2000. Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Uh, here's Rugrats, I believe. Wait, who is this? Team Rocket Rescue, Rocket Power. I think these were Rugrats. Uh, Rescue Copter. And of course, everybody's favorite, Jimmy White 2. Poker, I guess. Oh, cue ball, cue ball. He's so good, they made a second version. 007, I think we just saw this one. There may be some duplicates in here. Spice Girls, of course. Good for a laugh, we wanna play that one. Uh, here's Cyber Tiger, kind of an interesting version of uh, Tiger Woods. Rip up the rules book, anything goes. Kind of, kind of fun. You made him kind of look clowny. Pooh's Party Game. Like Winnie the Pooh. And of course, now we're getting some more my style action. Rainbow Six. All right, let's scooch them down a little bit more. And we're getting there. Castlevania. This was Symphony of the Night. Kind of a fun game. NCAA 99. Some FIFA, FIFA, FIFA. I'm gonna call it FIFA. Oh, 10 pin alley. I didn't even know I had this one. I always gotta have a bowling game in there. NFL Blitz. Rebel Assault 2. That's a two disker. I think it's two. It's at least two. There's one. Two. Put it back in there. there we go. Tomb Raider, The Last Revelation. And of course, another Tiger 99. Tiger made a lot of money on games. A lot of money. I know he didn't do them. He just licensed his name. But uh, Die Hard Trilogy. Three Maximum Adventures. NASCAR 99. But here's something. Used game. PlayStation 1 Pro Pinball. Big Race USA. I like how they photocopied the, uh, I don't even know if that's the right cover. I think they just put a cover on it. That's interesting. Stuart Little 2. Oh, another Die Hard trilogy. Oh, here's another snowmobile, Pol Polaris Snowcross. Of course, they did a Skidoo one, Polaris, and uh, I think there might have been another one at some point. Marvel vs. Capcom. Always good for fun. Uh, Moto Racer, hang on. And then we have WCW Nitro. Is that Hulk Hogan? Yeah, it's Hulk Hogan. We have Dave Mira, Freestyle BMX. I wonder what he does now. Tomb Raider 3, Adventures of Laura Croft. We just got shades on here. I was like how they, they slightly exaggerated her in some, certain areas for the boys. Nothing wrong with that. We have Casper, a haunting 3D challenge. Here's a great one, Mega Man X5. I like the Mega Man series. And this one is, oh, Digimon 3. It's like the cover's missing from that one. That's fine. And I think I have this on the PC, Red Alert, Retaliation. A couple discs on that one. Army Man, Air Attack. Oh, here's Big Race USA. We do have a copy of that. We need to go through these and start uh, selling off the duplicates. Hardcore 4x4. Here's Dora, Explorer, Dora the Explorer. Barnyard Buddies, baby. Oh, yeah. Let's put that over here. Grab the next pile. We're getting there. We're almost, let's say, three-eighths of the way through. Cool Borders 2. And here's, here's one I got for Christmas. My wife got me this. She knows what I like. Xena, Warrior Princess. Oh, yeah, baby. Spyro. I think I do have two copies of this. I think I finally found one, and then I found another, a better version of it. Of course, Bridge Racer. This must be James. There's Crash 2. I mean, that nice holographic look. Kind of cool. And we have Dragonheart, Fire, Steel. Fire and Steel. Game Day 2000. Let's see. Ooh, Wild Arms 2. And a paper. And 
There's a loose crash warped. And believe it or not, I do have a huge stack of loose ones, which I don't think we're gonna go through today. Maybe we'll go through that. This one at PlayStation Underground. Let's see, just a bunch of, uh, I think some demos maybe. Demos, yeah. And of course, oh man, Scrabble Baby. Smurf Racing did a video on this. Really great game, a lot of fun. You like the Mario Kart type of games. Uh, Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2. Oh yeah, Monopoly. Oh, here's the other one, Spyro. I knew there was a second version of it. I bought, like I said, I bought, a, bought one and later on I found a nicer version. And, oh yeah, another Jimmy White 2. Cue ball. This one is Star Wars Masters. Okay. Buzz Lightyear. Tarzan. Actually, I think I played this one. Not too bad. Uh, Namco Museum 3. Volume 3. Great game. And Space Jam. I think Michael Jackson. Or not Michael Jackson. Uh, Michael Jordan. Sorry, Michael. ATV Quad Power Racing. Those are very popular. The ATVs at the time. Oh, another a sealed Ridge Racer. Yeah, I bought huge collections of stuff, so they're, like I said, there's going to be duplicates in here. Uh, cool Borders. Stuart Little 2. And here's a sealed Mobile Light Force. Let's see what's in here. Men in Black and uh, XS Junior League Dodgeball. So three pack for uh, whatever it was, $15. Kind of funny, somebody bought this, never even opened it. And we have Hot Wheels, Turbo Racing. We have IHRA, Drag Racing. Supercross 98. Game Day 99. Let's see, Dark Light Conflict. Ooh, this looks fun. I don't know if I've ever played that one. Tetris Plus. Oh, here's something. Oh, look at this. Pam Anderson, Pam Anderson VIP. I don't remember the TV show. I don't think I ever watched the TV show because I think it was pretty corny. But uh, she kind of played, uh, I was supposed to be a smart bimbo or something like that. Smart secret agent bimbo. I don't know, whatever. Uh, triple play 98. There you go. Face off 99. Always play some hockey. A PGA Tour 98. Games Day 98. Let's get this over here. Let me get another drinky poo. Come here, you. Ah. <clears throat> oh, here's a sick, uh, sealed Pac World, Pac Man World. A sealed uh, Tigger Honey Hunt, maybe? What's it say? Because you usually don't find too many of these guys. And if you usually do like the kids' ones, uh, they're usually pretty much destroyed. Yeah. Oh, Pac-Man. Let's see. Oh, Museum 3. Another one of those. Museum 1. Another one of these. This is sealed. Uh, Fighting Force. Okay. Let's see. Oh, Independence Day, the movie. That's kind of cool. Madden 2000. Got to get that. NCAA. Game Breakers. Oh, Polaris Snowcross, we got two of those. Rebel Assault 2, oh, come here. Nice thick one. And, oh, another Big Race USA. I guess we've got a whole bunch of those bad boys. Put that over here. Now we're going to go into, like, the special stuff. So we're almost at the end. And some of these, I think, this is where you can say that's special. Or maybe not, I don't know. I don't know you that well. Army Men. Uh, NFL Blitz. Billiards. It's a PlayStation. That's a PlayStation game. Yeah, these are just some loose pieces and parts. There you go. Uh, Kingsfield 2. Probably one you probably don't see very often out there. And here is... I don't know if that's a play. That's not a PlayStation game. Here is Dungeon Warrior 7. And some of these are actually four discs long. Some of these games. This one's just a two-disker. Shadow Tower. Uh, let's see. Oh, Goblins 2. Is that a PlayStation game? I, think, I, don't think, I don't think all these are PlayStation games. There's Emperor Battle for Dune. No, that's not it. Oh, here's Brugo. Azure Dreams. Probably not so common. Soul 
Bieber. Legacy of Cain. Okay. Uh, Magic. Battle Mage. The, the Gathering. Battle Mage. This one's Final Fantasy. Which one is this one? Tactics. And then we have Final Fantasy VIII. And I think this one's like uh, four discs. Three discs. Three discs. Kind of cool. That's kind of... Remember how much data you can get on a PlayStation. This really pushed it to the limit, and you had to go more and more discs. And they went all out. Very worth getting that. Let's see. Here's like... Uh, let's see. PlayStation Underground. Yeah, CD Magazine. So these are demos from the CD Magazine. That's pretty cool. I think that's the same one. Uh, Wild Arms, pretty cool. That's a big one. And another big one. Let's see, this one is Valkyrie, Valkyrie, Valkyrie Profile. Kind of cool. Multiple discs. Let me grab the next pile. Come here, you. Come on over here. <clears throat> okay. Let's see. This looks like a PC game. Is this a PC game? Privateer, yeah, that's a PC game. Final Fantasy VII. This one's just the same as the last one. A couple discs in there. Kind of cool. We have, let's see, Aundra. Aundra? Not sure what that one is. That's kind of interesting. One I've never seen before. Here's number two. Kind of cool. Uh, Vandal Hearts. Yeah, they did some really fantastic games. That just the stuff that's not, you know, they were not big sellers at the time because not everybody wants to play that kind of game, especially the uh, like D and D type games, you know. And we have, let's see, it's a PC game. Here's another one, uh, Beyond the Beyond. Nice big thick one. Star Ocean. Nice big one. A lot of, a lot of these two discers or four discers. Sudoken, another thick one. VR Golf. Uh, Armyman Air Attack. Jet Moto. Uh, Perfect Weapon. And Rebel Assault 2. I think we had that one already. Tecmo's Deception. Invitation to Darkness. Kind of cool. And we have... Dark Forces, Star Wars. Kind of cool. Get over there. We have Legend of the Dra Dragoon. Nice big thick one. And then we have Vagrant Story. Kind of looks very interesting to play. Very colorful looking. I, I gotta try some of these. I haven't had time to play a lot of these games. Tales of Destiny. Namco. Kind of cool looking. Grandia. Yeah, some of these, I never even heard of these. And Breath of Fire 3, the classic role-playing game. So role-playing. Then we have, let's see, what's this? The Blood Pledge. Oh, my PC, I don't know. Then we have Legend of Cain. Saw that one already. Sarge's Heroes. Colony Wars 3, Red Sun. Madden 2001. Let's see what we got here. That's some kind of music. A few things got mixed in in the move. Let's see, Rage. That's some music too. Maybe these are musics. That's my that's a PC game. Uh, PC game. PC game. And one last one. Shadow Madness. Pretty cool. I think there were some more other games around here somewhere. But anyway, that's kind of like the main haul of them. So anyway, quite a lot of games. Um, it's kind of shocking to kind of look and see how many I got here and how many I've never played. You can see kind of quite a lot of games. But that's kind of the haul that we got so far. And I've been collecting them off and on. And these games, PlayStation games, very hard to find, especially now. Uh, you do find them. Like I said, the only place I really find these now uh, garage sales, uh, Facebook Marketplace. I'm going to start kind of, kind of watching because sometimes people want to sell their whole collection. People don't want to sell onesie twos; they want to sell it all. 
or are they jumping off at a Goodwill, or are they going to a game store and get like a buck a piece for the games. So that's another good place to go to. Pawn stores, pawn stores are a good place, but uh, I just pick them up as I find them. So it obviously has been paying off because we got quite a lot of games here. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's my collection. I want you, that's you. Have a great day.